Hello everybody, Slim Kirby here. Welcome to week three of the Star Warrior Cup. This is the third tournament. The first special tournament, mind you, because uh, things are actually in mirror mode this time. That's right, they're in mirror mode. I think they're in mirror mode. Okay, yeah, they are. They definitely are. Okay, so... Uh, yeah, those are the special conditions for this week. Uh, items are also on frantic mode, so there's going to be a lot of items screwing everybody over, but that's the way Mario Kart works, so why not embrace it, says I. Whew, uh, what a week. Uh, it's been a very, very busy week for me. Uh, a lot of stuff going on in the gaming world, particularly the Super Smash Brothers world. I'll be going over that shortly, but very quickly, let me go over some of the uh, tweets I've been getting for the Star Warrior Cup. want to make sure I'm keeping track of that this time. Let's see, um, I think it's time to make my first foray in Slim Kirby Star Warrior Cup, and on my birthday, no less, from Wolf of Storms. Uh, good job, uh, happy birthday, and I hope you are uh, ready to race. Let's see, good luck some Kirby and the others in the Star Warrior Cup. I am Renolf, and I'll see you all on the racetrack from Megalomaniac. Okay, good luck to you. Time for week three of the Star Warrior Cup. I'm sure it'll go better than last week from General Snivy. Uh, sample Man using my we me this week. Okay, good. Look out for that. Mirror Mode, called it. Let's see how it goes from uh, John Lewis Smith. Okie dokie, I'm actually going to join some Kirby Star Warrior Cup for the first time ever. Best of luck to all participants. From good friend of mine, BJ Wanlund. And I do apologize if you can hear some background noise. I do have my window open. It's a nice day. Nice cool breeze coming in. Which means I'm excited about that. Okay, let's see. In this race we have uh, Yo Lee. We have SMG24, Barry, Nintega, John2, Eric with a K, and Raphael. Alright. I'm going to go for Toad Harbor. I'm going to say hello. Everyone seems very excited about their choices. Oh! And they're going to leave! <laughs> okay, maybe they didn't like the choices or something. I don't know. Mm, that was very, very odd, though. So let's see, uh, Smash Brothers has been the big topic of discussion. I think, uh, okay, it's not in there right now, but I was going to say it's been on the frickin' uh, Twitter trends list for a long time th this week. Uh, the game is out now in Japan. We're all very familiar with the full character roster, the stages, all of that stuff. And uh, the United States, Americans, and you know, pretty much a lot of other people got the demo for the North American version. I am included in that, by the way. Um, I actually got a code from a good friend of mine, Rion Fushiba, I think. I probably butchered that name, but uh, he was uh, very nice. He gave me a code to download the demo, and I am very thankful for that. So thank you very much, Rion. Uh, as for the demo, I have been enjoying it. Um, I'm not disappointed about the content they have because it is just a demo. That's what it's supposed to be. It's not supposed to give you very much, just enough to uh, basically know how the game plays and uh, how a few of the characters play. Keep in mind, there used to be demos like for platforming games that were like only one level, so... I mean, they're being really generous with the demo they do have for us, so I don't think there's any reason to be disappointed. Uh, in the demo, you can play as Mario, Link, Pikachu, uh, Mega Man, and the Villager. I really love playing as Mega Man. I love playing as the Villager. Uh, the other characters feel fine, but they're not characters I play with a lot in Smash Bros. normally, so I am not that interested in using them. But Still, though, I do recognize they've done some good things with Link, they've, they've done some good things with Mario, and... Uh, I'm kind of neutral about Pikachu, but I've always kind of been neutral about Pikachu. Oh my god, second place Bullet Bill. You don't see that very often. But as for the full game, I'm not going to get into too many spoilers, but uh, I'm just going to kind of go over the character roster and stuff from what I've seen. 
I feel like a lot of people are making a big deal about the character roster not being good, when in reality it's a fine roster. I just wish they would have handled it differently. For one, I wish that there would have been less characters available at the start, because I feel like when people look at the characters they can lock, they're kind of uh, more excited about the secret aspect of it. They're not really, you know, they're not really minding like what characters there are in the game. They want to unlock the characters and you know, do that whole process. That's what made Melee, I think, so great, is because you found out all of these characters, and you're like, oh my god, I finally unlocked this character. Good, I can play as him. So, that's what made Melee so exciting in that aspect, and that wasn't really present for Brawl or Melee, because, uh, uh, Brawl or the new game, my bad, because all of the characters, so many of them are available at the start, there's not really a lot of unlockable potential. I mean, we already, like, in Melee, I believe, uh, you just barely had half of the characters available. And these game, games, and Brawl included, you have, like, 75% of the characters unlockable already. And, uh, I don't know, I don't really like that aspect of it. But otherwise, I mean, I think the roster's fine. I don't think the roster's really that bad at all. It's a good roster. Uh, there are a lot of clone characters, and, uh... <laughs> For those who have been following Twitter, I've been going on a huge tirade against Dark Pit. I think Dark Pit is like the worst character. You know, I can live with Dr. Mario. He was a favorite in Melee. He was pretty cool. And I can live with Lucina because she's a female. Maybe a female Marth, but... You know, she's a female character. She's from a slightly different universe than what Marth is. So, I mean... At least those kind of make sense in retrospect. Dark Pit is just... It's a clone of Pit with a clone moveset. That could have very easily been used as an alternate costume instead. Dr. Mario, I mean, he's pretty much Mario with doctor clothes, but he has, like, a different standard attack. Uh, he has the Mario Tornado, while Mario has Flood. You know, they did they actually try to do some stuff different with Dr. Mario. He may seem lazy, but I just feel like Dark Pit's a lot lazier. And just to pour more salt on the wound, they gave Dark Pit Zelda's final smash. So, he didn't even get Pit's final smash, he got freaking Zelda's final smash. He's already a clone character of someone else, he has to get a clone final smash too, so it's like, oh my god. But yeah, Light Arrow is definitely the uh, landmaster of this game, for sure. But honestly, as far as the, all the characters go, I'm more disappointed about the stages than really the characters. There's not a lot of stages, and for the stages they do have, a majority of them seem to be like retro stages, stages that are returning from old games, and I don't know, I, I think there should be, at the very, lead, at the very least, a ratio of 60% to 40 in favor of new stages, at least. That's just my thing. But, um, honestly, I mean, it controls very well. That's one thing I was really excited about. It does kind of take a little bit to get used to on the 3DS, but it feels really good after you play enough of it, so... I'm very, very excited about that. I'm glad that it controls well, because that was my main, main, uh, fear when actually getting the game. So yeah, I'm very much looking forward. We have less than uh, three weeks to go for the game. I think it's going to be great. I think it's going to be a good time for everybody. It's going to be a really, really great game. I don't think any of us will be disappointed. Also, I just totally got first right there. <laughs> I totally got first. Uh, let's see. Um, go ahead and look at some tweets. I've been kind of ignoring that, I guess. Uh... My ass is sore from getting hit with so many red shells at Electrodome from S. Aturnis. Well, 7th place isn't too terrible after getting hosed early on and Technico Technodrome and being in the back all race from BJ Wanlund. 4th uh, place on the 4th race, better than 7th any day from General Snivy. Not doing so bad for Mirror Mode, John Lewis Smith. 
Uh, the first four races are done with, and Frantic Mode is killing me. So many shells and bob bombs from Odin Smack. Odin Smack is streaming again, so thank you again for streaming again, Odin. I appreciate it. I drove like a drunk driver on Bowser's Castle from S. Aternus. Ugh, got 11th, and I even said to go easy on me. <laughs> oh, BJ, you, you can't do that. You can't, you can't just expect them to go easy on you, man. Uh, where'd everyone go from John Lewis Smith? I don't know. I think that's when everybody randomly left for some reason. I don't exactly know what happened there. As for notifications... Also, thanks, Slim Kirby. I suck at mirror mode and struggle mightily. <laughs> oh, PJ. Can't help it, dude. Can't help it. Should have joined the first two. Wasn't mirror mode then. As for other gaming things going on, um, oh god, really looking forward to Hyrule Warriors now. Yeah, Motorcycle, I think Motorcycle's also looking forward to Hyrule Warriors. It looks so good, it looks exactly what I've always wanted from a Zelda game. Hack and slashing action of Dynasty Warriors in a Zelda game, that's, oh god, that's freaking awesome. I freaking cannot wait to, uh, actually play that game so much. Uh, I want that game so badly. I'm actually more excited about Hyrule Warriors than Smash Bros. now. That's going to be a very unpopular opinion, I know, but I don't care. I've, I've wanted something like this for years. Ever since I first discovered Dynasty Warriors 3, I've wanted a game like Hyrule Warriors so badly. As for games I've been playing, um... I actually started a playthrough of uh, Legend of Zelda Wind Waker, the HD edition, because I have had that since I've gotten Mario Kart 8. That was the free game I got for uh, registering via Club Nintendo. Oh, damn it. Yeah, that was the free game I got. So uh, I've been um, playing that. I'm playing it on Hero Mode, which I've never done before. Hero mode's pretty rough, uh, not gonna lie, um... Frickin' hero mode, you have to, uh, you take double damage from everything. And you don't actually get any heart pickups throughout the journey, so... You can die very easily, especially early on in the game when you only have three hearts. And currently, I just beat the, uh, Earth Temple, uh, before the tournament. Not, like, exactly before, but... Uh, the last time I played, I beat the Earth Temple, so I still have to do the Wind Temple. Then I gotta do the, uh, Triforce Shard Quest and all of the, uh, getting 100% in the game and all that stuff. But yeah, it's been a lot of fun. I do like the, uh, Wii U controls. I didn't think I'd like the gyro controls at first, and I'm still a little iffy about them when it comes to the, uh, grappling hook, but... I actually uh, like using uh, it for the bow and arrow and the boomerang. And, well, for the hook shot too, once I get it. Fifth! Damn it, baby Roro. You're not Snack, are you? Did I just lose the Snack? I probably just lost the Snack. No, I didn't. That's the computer. Okay, never mind. I lost to X. Eh, fifth is the worst I've done so far, so it's not too bad. Okay, let's see. Okay, nothing new on this front. <laughs> oh, right, I forgot. Um, before uh, this tournament, um, <laughs> before this uh, tournament started, I found this article where uh, somebody actually got a one-day ban for online mode in Smash Bros. 3DS because, uh, they were using Peach, and when they pulled out a tournament, a turnip, they pulled out a item, and because it was for glory mode, uh, that's like not allowed. So he got a one-day ban for it. That's hilarious. Yeah, well, it's kind of on Sakurai's behalf. He should, he should have uh, not overlooked that, or the team behind the game should have overlooked that. See, the motorcycle's agreeing with me, too. I might have to close my window here in a second. 
I don't want to, it's a nice breeze, but I don't want you guys to get annoyed by constant sounds like that. So yeah, after I do my 16 races, I'm probably gonna go play more Wind Waker or something. Although I may take a nap, I'm still freaking tired for some reason. Sundays are like my busiest days now, because I have, uh... I have Star Warrior Cup in the early afternoon, and then the evening I have uh, practice for my Smite team. So it's like I don't get any frickin' rest on Sundays. Although it'll be nice, because next Sunday, uh, I think I've mentioned this in my video before this, but there's not going to be a tournament next week. Uh, after every third tournament, I'm going to take a week break. So there's not going to be a tournament after this. I think this will be good because I won't have to spend as much money on prizes. I'm still looking for another way to do prizes as well because, uh, as you guys know, there was a tie last week for the Star Warrior Cup. Uh, speaking of which, Aaron, I still need to get in contact with you. I don't know if I, like, not seen your message or not, but I have your prize, like, right here. I can, like, pick it up in a second. I can't show it to you or anything, but, you know, it's right here on my desk. I, like, quite physically and literally have it in my possession. So I would need to give that to you at some point. Hey, X. Oh, damn it. Oh, come on! Blue Shell still went for me. Uh, the, th the thing is, I could have mushroom boosted out of it. I just, it just happened so fast. I didn't even think about it. Ugh. I'm coming, X. I'm probably not going to catch him though. There's no way that's going to hit him. Ah, So close. I mean, I'm happy I'm getting second places. This is probably the best I've ever done for the Star Warrior Cup, but still... I want to frickin', uh, I want to frickin' make the top 20 for once. I've never done that before. Also, poor Nate. Okay, let's see. Who do we have next? Oh, I think we have the uh, waiting room next. Yep, I'm searching for players. Okay, let's see. Any new messages? Oh, yeah, definitely. Uh, first, first of the day, and on Shy Guy Falls, no less, from Lou Smith. Good job, buddy. I'm happy for you. Uh, speaking of Shy Guy Falls, I'm not doing either any of these. Okay, looks like I'm probably going to have to wait until things calm down. I'll, uh, search my messages first before I do any of that. I can also make a tweet myself. First four races are done. Doing a lot better today. But you guys are still so relentless. Star Warrior Cup, and make sure I don't spell Star Wario Cup this time. Okay. Awesome. So yeah, I'm going to sit back until I get into a new race, uh, so I'll see you guys in a little bit. Okay, we're back, guys. I also shut my window, too, so there shouldn't be as much noise. I'm with, oh god, General Snivy. This is not good. I'm against my, my second lethal enemy. General Snivy and Virtus are like the uh, the evil side of the Star Warrior Cup. They're Moon Warriors. <laughs> okay, no, the Moon's not evil. Let's see. I'm trying to think of a Kirby reference. Uh, okay, Star Warriors, and there's the 
shoot, um... Not the Dark Matter Warriors, that sounds lame. The Marks Warriors, from, like, Superstar. That's what they'll be. So, you know, they're, they're from the Star Warrior universe, but they're Marks Warriors. That sounds like a good idea. Also, I'm getting destroyed by computers and, uh... The evil general himself. Now, a lot of people made a comment in the, la the last uh, session's videos about, you know, why, why would he, why should he have picked Oshawott when uh, Snivy actually has the advantage? That is true, that is true. Snivy does have the advantage over Oshawott, so. Oh, ah, that piranha plant killed me. Oh god. Damn it! I thought I could get through. God, what am I doing? What the hell am I doing? Maybe I can actually catch up now. Yes, with the bullet bill I can. I love how when someone has a star, you just nudge them over. Oh god, another bullet bill. So many bullet bills in frantic mode. <laughs> Oh, come on! Yeah, that was kind of bullcrap. Not gonna. That was even more bullcrap. Oh my god. That lightning was just. No. Welcome to Mario Kart! Yeah, yeah, I got it. I'm not gonna be all frickin' salty about this. You know, I'm not getting very many people today. I think it's not good if I uh, start like 15 minutes late. I should start on time. Because that's usually when I have the, like, filled up rooms. Now I'm just racing, like, one person. General Snivy, of all people.